Exposing the Real Wizard of Oz. Page 66 of this blog curious page indeed to be exposing the real Wizard of Oz. The chart below begins to illustrate the veiled deception of the centuries yet hidden in plain sight. If time allows, much more will be shown, regarding the original story of the Wizard of Oz by L. Frank Baum, written in 1900. Know this, that the whole Wizard of Oz story is the story of the manipulation of the money systems of the world, and in particular, the financial, fiancé system of the United States of America. L. Frank Baum is buried in Forest Lawn Cemetery in Los Angeles, as is Michael Jackson, who played the straw man in the Wiz movie produced in 1979. The symbolism in the original story and how it relates to the chaos in the world today will be shown on this page. L. Frank Baum, author of The Wizard of Oz, The Wizard of Oz was written in 1900 by L. Frank Baum. L. Frank Baum was a theosophist, a belief system that investigated a number of esoteric notions such as Hermeticism, Christian Kabbalah, Rosicrucianism, Alchemy, Occult, etc. These studies are in many ways similar to those undertaken in secret societies such as Freemasonry, and similar to other religions, in that, the faithful believe the nonsense presented previously by other varied religious thinkers, none of which is aware of the truth themselves, but pass on mumbo-jumbo concepts supporting ridiculous notions conjured up by religious twits who have gone before. L. Frank Baum's works predicted such century later commonplaces as television, augmented reality, laptop computers, the master key, wireless telephones, TikTok of Oz, women in high risk, action heavy occupations, Mary Louise in the country, and the ubiquity of advertising on clothing, Aunt Jane's nieces at work. In other words, something was inspiring Baum to see into the future as will be evident from some short examples included in the original book, The Wizard of Oz. The whole world runs of money. The word money is a hidden form of the words moon and eye, referring to the moon goddess, the mother, and to the all seeing eye, the sun, or son of God sometimes described as the light of the world. The moon eye, money, is the sun and the moon, or Solomon. The sun, sun and moon, men are symbolic of the male and female genitalia, and the reproductive sex organs. The sun, sun sex organ is the penis, or spine, the very backbone of life, and has its money symbolized by the lowly penny, or pennies. This is the spine of the Sphinx, the Lion King, and is the reason that Lincoln is on the USA pennies. This alludes to, or suggests, what L. Frank Baum refers to as the yellow brick road. Yellow equals yellow equals holy equals holy brick equals stone or stones which form a road. Road equals door equals door, I am the door, no man enters but by me. The road is the path is the door. Examining the statue of the Sphinx of Egypt reveals that the original object was carved out of one massive stone, but restorations over the centuries included smaller bricks or stones to fill in the parts that had been eroded away. These bricks refer to the ebb and flow of the money or financial systems of the world, that come and go, that ultimately lead to the end goal of total control of the whole world system that attempts to place the whole body of humanity into an intellectual and religious system of physical and psychological bondage. This end goal is meant to veil, or hide, through suffering, sorrow, pain, and death, the original eternal wisdom state, that is reality, and that is who and what we really are. Attempting also, to hide the fact that humanity has no basis in truth or reality, but is simply a tool of the Luciferian mindset, conjured up to distract and deceive, with the hopes of destroying or at least controlling, the all-knowing paradise state. The moon, moon is the Vesica Pisces, which is symbolized by a crescent moon, the flower of life, where two overlapping moons form the female genitalia in the center. When these two reproductive organs copulate, life is regenerated and the financial money systems of the world flow with the illusion of creating and sustaining life. This is what the story of the Wizard of Oz is all about. The chart above shows how there are two letter O's, pronounced as O-H-Z, which form the two eyes of the O-W-L, easily seen when viewed at a distance, or by focusing on the smaller picture of the dollar bill just below the larger dollar bill. As mentioned on page 65 of this blog, the yellow brick road is hiding subliminals such as the recent Libra scandal which has been going on for literally decades, but has only now surfaced, to bring forth the obvious that the whole financial system was established to eventually lead the masses of humanity into a place of slaughter, where the suffering and horror was meant to be experienced by all. That suffering and horror can only be sidestepped by realizing that the whole of the 3D illusory plane is a sham, an utter fabrication, a fraud. And as the Wizard of Oz story will show, everything has been conjured up for this very illusory moment of deceit. Yellow Brick Road equals Holy Brick Road equals Libby Oer and Cad Death.
equals the death of the financial money systems of the world. The death of the money system is the sacrifice of the son and mother, the sacrifice of the pillars of Solomon's temple. Why now? So why conjure up the illusion of an owl to act as a subliminal and hypnotic suggestion in the manipulation of reality and truth? Simply put, an owl can see in the dark. The owl represents Oz, the wizard, the one who goes on his night journey, the journey taken by Muhammad as he rode on his magic horse Barak, Barak, from Mecca Saudi Arabia, all the way to Alexa, Alaska, in one night. That night has lasted for many centuries, and has surfaced in our 3D illusory conscious reality in the form of Batman Barack Obama, the Dark Knight Rising. Combining a blood sacrifices, earthquakes, and financial scandals the like of which could never be imagined or fabricated by humanity alone. There is obviously a hidden mind, a hidden hand in all of this this is the wizard hiding behind the curtain, the veil of deceit. Curtain equals currency equals current equals currency equals money equals moon eye equals sun and moon, mother equals Solomon equals Solomon. The purpose of the Wizard of Oz story, is to place before us, the suggestion that this is the plan, the path, the way this illusory plane is going to unfold. At the very same instance, not showing itself for what it is, but hiding in the background, conjuring up all manner of suffering and pain, where the rich get richer, and the poor. Well they just get more and more poor. The rich know nothing of what's transpiring, they just like getting rich at any cost, and the poor, well they just get poorer and costing all. The Wizard of Oz, the original story, the first thing to recognize in the Wizard of Oz story, is what some of the characters and places names really mean. Dorothy equals Theodore equals Theodore equals Theodore, or God's door and refers to Theodore Roosevelt, who was president at the time of the writing of The Wizard of Oz in 1900. Don't let the fact that Dorothy is a sweet little girl in the story, and that President Roosevelt was a macho type dude. In the Luciferian agenda, the sex of an individual scripted character matters little, as all characters are androgynous, sexless, and are only conjured up to deliver a subliminal suggestion. The main entrance to Yellowstone equals Holy Brick Road is called the Roosevelt ARCH, and is named after Theodore Roosevelt. Then there's the Emerald City. Dorothy and her three friends go on a journey, the night journey, down a yellow brick road eventually coming to the Emerald City. Emerald City equals ALD Mere Site equals OLD Mary Site equals OLD Marcy equals Old Mary Sea equals Pacific Ocean at the Emerald City of Seattle. Al. Oz Capitol Hill, immediately below are four charts borrowed from P.27 of this site. The first chart shows a satellite picture illustrating the owl outline created by the shape of the roads and structures of the Capitol building grounds. Being that the owl equals Oz, this shows in symbolic fashion that the whole government system of the USA is built upon the mythological notions of ancient Egyptian owl worship, which is the worship of Oz, which in turn is the manipulation of all things in society using the financial money system to create an impoverished and captive fascist type state, not only in the USA, but throughout the world. Implementing the deceitful and corrupting influences of the hidden wizard agenda, manipulates and imprisons the three illusory body of humanity to focus on the suffering, believing it to be real, thereby hindering our focus on reality and truth, which is our original paradise state. This ultimately conjures up chaos, resentment, retaliation and reaction etc. all of which is exactly what the Luciferian, California, mindset and agenda hope to accomplish. The secrecy of Oz, is the secrecy of the secret societies throughout the ages, and in the case of the USA as a nation, it begins in the East in New York and Washington DC and follows the spine of the lion at 37 degrees N, ultimately ending on the coast of California, at San Francisco and Los Angeles, the center for creating and conjuring up illusions that in turn manipulate the country and the world. On this first chart, immediately above the Capitol building, right where the owl's eyes are located, this is the location that fits precisely with the USA $1 bill which has the picture of George Washington on it. The front of the $1 bill, of course, is just a picture of the owl's eyes, which can be easily seen when the bill is made very small or viewed at a distance in dim light, or by squinting the eyes and holding it at arm's length. The fact that this dollar bill design was built into the design of the park area on the north side of the Capitol building, indicates the extreme importance that the OWL, or Oz, plays in the whole universal scheme of things. The word owl equals Oz equals Oz as in a circle, or the letter Rho, which in turn is a reference to the all-seeing eye, or the illusory fabricated creator god. Of course, the letter O is the 15th letter of the alphabet, which secret societies insist, is the number most closely associated with god. The eye of god, the eyes of Oz, are the eyes of the one dollar bill, and in turn, 
symbolically suggest that money is God, and in the 3D sense of things, money is God. For the whole 3D illusory plane lives and breathes upon the accumulation of money, or dies with the lack thereof. The next chart just shows more clearly how perfectly the owl design has been worked into the form of the Capitol building grounds, and projecting out onto the National Mall, which of course is the symbolic representation of the USA as a nation, which has been shown repeatedly throughout this site. The cornerstone for the Capitol building was laid on September 18, 1793. The cornerstone was laid by George Washington, dressed in full Masonic attire. One day, 218 years later, George Washington's face on the $1 bill would depict the beak and throat of the OWL, or Oz, which would herald in the fabricated new age of a land and world experiencing a deeply induced trance state. A world heavily indoctrinated in lunacy. George Washington's Freemasonic dollar bill face looks out across the National Mall, all the way to the Washington Monument, the phallic slash pinnace slash Benny slash spine of lion symbol of regeneration, which coincides with the four corner cross states at 37 degrees N. Just beyond this 555-foot high penis, pennies, stands the Lincoln Memorial. As mentioned previously, it is Abraham Lincoln, the Lion King, symbolic of the Sphinx, who has his likeness on the USA pennies. Of course, there's a song called Pennies from Heaven, sung by Bing Crosby. Here's the words to that song, so keep in mind the word pennies relates to penis and procreation by cleansing the world with a flood. Every time it rains, it trains pennies from heaven don't you know each cloud contains pennies from heaven? You'll find your fortune falling all over town, be sure that your umbrella is upside down, trade them for a package of sunshine and flowers if you want the things you love, you must have showers, so when you hear it thunder, don't run under a tree there'll be pennies from heaven for you and me, every time it rains, it rains, pennies from heaven, don't you know each cloud contains, pennies from heaven? You'll find your fortune fallen, all over town, be sure that your umbrella is upside down, trade them for a package of sunshine and flowers if you want the things you love you must have showers, so when you hear it thunder, don't run under a tree there'll be pennies from heaven for you and for me, the suggestion attached to the sunshine and flowers refers to the son of God, the light of the world which will be sacrificed to cleanse the world with flowers, pronounced flow ERS, as in flowing water. The coordinates of the capitol building are 38.5 degrees N, which is exactly one half of 77, the number of perfection and completion the other coordinate being 77 degrees W. Adding 3 plus 8 plus 5 equals 16 again, the Lion King number. Adding 7 plus 7 equals 14, the Conception number. Multiplying 7 times 7 equals 49, the USA slash Canada border, which symbolically identifies the 11 western states as the Rock of Sacrifice. Again, multiplying 3 by 8 by 5 equals 120, the number of degrees equaling one third of a circle. Yet again the number 120 is the distance in degrees between two prime colors on the color wheel. The next chart illustrates how perfectly the $1 bill fits into the park area immediately adjacent to the Capitol building. This last chart shows how even the first street knee and first street say relate to the number ones on the dollar bill. As well, the trees on the edges of the dollar bill and the accompanying circles in the center of the trees coincide perfectly with each other. This is Oz, the land of the wizard the home of the government of the land of the free. The owl, Oz of Bohemian Grove, 38.5 degrees north, immediately below is a photograph of the 40-foot tall owl, Oz, at Bohemian Grove. This particular owl, Oz, is located at exactly 38.5 degrees N, the very same coordinate as the Capitol building owl, Oz in Washington, D.C. Again, it was here that much of the atomic bomb, Manhattan Project concepts, which brought about the production of the bombs that fell on Japan during the Second World War, were devised. This is Oz, the wise one, working his magic completely hidden in plain sight. The owl, Oz located at Bohemian Grove is the focal point of a secret ritual called the cremation of care, held every year in mere summer. The suggestion attached to this phrase, cremation of care equals burning of the wreck equals burning of the rock the eleven western states. Cremation equals cream cyan equals the richness and fat of the milk equals cream equals the letter C, or C and the rim equals Mary, or the Sea of Mary, the Pacific Ocean. Occupy Wall Street equals OWS equals O's equals Oz equals O's equals death equals death equals theity equals theo death equals God sacrifice equals son of God equals cyan equals sun and moon equals Solomon equals two circles of light equals two O's equals Oz equals OWS equals Occupy Wall Street, as illustrated in the above heading. The Occupy Wall Street movement is a crucial component of the Oz financial manipulation of truth and reality. 
in the 3D sense, what the Occupy movement is asking for would seem to be fair and just. However, the 3D plane is anything but fair and just, and no matter how much success Occupy and the Arab Spring succeed, the ultimate result will be greater tyranny, poverty, suffering and chaos. The rich this movement hopes to supplant are the witches of Oz. The wicked witch of the East and West equals the wicked rich of the East and West. This refers to the East and West USA, and to a lesser extent the East and West geopolitical arena. The good witch of the North and South equals the good rich of the North and South. This refers to the North and South towers of the WTC, Solomon's Temple, and the world polar regions, which will be used in sacrifice and cleansing of the old world order. The wicked rich of the East is destroyed in the Wizard of Oz story, at the very onset. The cyclone in Kansas has Dorothy's house ripped into the sky and lands on the wicked rich of the East, crushing her to death. Only her silver shoes remain out from under the crushed house. Which shoes Dorothy admires and proceeds to wear, completely unaware of the magical powers they possess. The wicked witch, rich of the West refers to the eleven western United States, which rich witch is destroyed by a bucket of water thrown by Dorothy, Theodore, God's door, Roosevelt equals Rose Levy sacrifice equals rising sea. Which bucket is the water bearer of Alaska? This water bearer enters from the north through the north gate of Yellowstone, the Roosevelt ARCH, as the seismic activity associated with Yellowstone, the Holy Stone, is unleashed from the Emerald City of Seattle and Mount Olympus, Washington, all the way to the Holy Stone of Judgment and beyond, reaching Kansas, the home of Dorothy, with its southern border resting at 37 degrees north. The state of Kansas coincides with the Millennium Hotel just to the east of what was the destroyed World Trade Center in NYC. This massive black block of death sits as a death marker at the perimeter of the four corner cross states, immediately adjacent to Colorado, Dolorosa, the Way of Sorrows, the Rising Dollar, the Sacrifice Dollar, the Sacrificed Sun slash Sun slash Science slash Money, the Way of Sorrows, Soros, George Soros, a supporter of Occupy Wall Street, who has now invested heavily in the Yellow Brick Road. Lions and tigers and bears oh fucking my.